alcohol related problems which result from drinking too much, too fast or too often affect more than 14 million U.S. adults ages 18 and older. Dr. George Koob, an internationally recognized expert on alcohol and addiction, is here with tips to identify signs of an alcohol use disorder and, of course, ways to get help. Doctor, thank you so much for being with us. Oh, you're most welcome. Well, let's start with some of those signs that somebody either can recognize uh, possibly in themselves or possibly with a loved one. Well, one sign is overindulgence, obviously. So uh, we define a binge on alcohol uh, of five drinks in a male, four drinks in a female in a two hour period. So if you've if you've been engaging in binge drinking, that's that's a potent sign. Another sign is uh, perhaps uh, you know, getting in, you know, embarrassing yourself at an office party or uh, during the holidays, and those are two signs. A, a more severe sign is actually, you know, uh, obtaining a, a DUI, uh, you know, uh, driving under the influence citation or, or multiple DUIs. So if we see somebody, uh, a, f a friend or a family member that may be having some of these signs that were recognized, what do we do? How do we help? Well, it is a difficult problem, and one of the things I, I recommend first is to is to check out Rethinking Drinking, which is a website that we have uh, at NIH. You just type that into any search engine, Rethinking Drinking. You'll get a lot of information about alcohol, what is a binge, uh, how much alcohol is in a drink, how many calories in a drink, um, and, and what alcohol does to the body as, as the dose uh, increases. So that's a first start. A second start is, is actually to contact a, maybe the primary care doctor um, who can uh, elaborate on the, on the problems of, of, of excessive drinking. But, and then finally, maybe not be confrontational. We don't recommend confrontation, but be in, engaging more motivational interviewing type skills like asking the person, you know, maybe you'll feel better if you don't drink so much and maybe you'll be able to engage in some of those New Year's resolutions like exercise or losing weight or saving money for perhaps the car you want to get. Well, I know uh, wonderfully that there's a lot of resources online available to us. What about when someone's ready for treatment? Are, what are we looking at when it comes to options? So we recommend going to alcohol treatment. That's one word, dot .nih.gov. That's alcoholtreatment.niaa.nih.gov. You'll find there um, all the different treatment options, um, uh, what questions you should ask of a treatment program, what exactly is an alcohol use disorder. So there's a lot of information there that'll help out people So uh, if they go to that website. Well, doctor, I know this is going to be a, a lifesaver for a lot of families and for somebody that's needing to hear this this morning. So I want to thank you so much. Oh, you're most welcome. Don't go anywhere. The Morning Blend, we'll be right back.